Hi guys, wherever you are around the world, thank you very much for joining this webinar. Um, and there he is, Mr. Andy Dem is just jumping on. Uh, nice. Thanks to Dan for sorting out the music. Debatable choice in music as usual, Mr. Tyler, but <laughs> it is what it is. So thank you very much for being here. Andy, how are you doing today? Good, mate, good. I'm a, I'm a managing position as we speak. So uh, you may see me turning around sometimes. <laughs> just need a cat and then you got the evil laugh. So you just need a cat when you swivel in your chair. It'll be, uh, that's it. it'll be quite good. I've got a so cat. look guys, Andy did a, um, I know that's why I said it. Um, Andy did a video in the group. Hopefully you saw that where Bitcoin reached a Fibonacci D. Now, if you have no Scooby-Doo's what that means and why that's important to high probability, low risk trading, then you're in the right place because today you're going to be breaking down uh, what some of this means, right? And how they can start to, to put it into a process for themselves to, to find these high uh, probability, low risk trading opportunities like you talk about. Yeah, I mean, what I'm going to cover, I'm going to cover a lot more than that. So today I'm going to be talking about essentially, um, well, well, we'll get into the presentation, but the, the idea is, is to show people what's possible once you understand, um, you know, what goes into a good trade idea. And that's all it is. It's just the trade idea. So, you know, the, we, we were speaking about this trade in our coaching sessions this morning um and i and i but i'm going to do a video tomorrow for everybody so everybody that's in the group i'm going to break down exactly why i took these trades um they're still running uh ethereum is about to hit target and i think bitcoin is not too far from that as well so that will i i expect both but before the presentation finishes we should be hitting our target so that's you know it's a decent day um We've, we've made just over 3K so far. Um, you know, we, but the, the key thing here, guys, it's not just over 3K. That's in half a day risking um, about $800, so $400 on each trade. So it kind of puts into perspective, you know, you're looking at a three, four to one in half a day. So it's not like, you know, people are looking at that. That's something that you do in a few days or in a week or a month. That's I took it this morning, great entry, and it's pretty much the low. And that's the, that's the way we teach you to trade. It's turning points. The, you don't want to be getting in. So it's kind of a misconception where people say, you know, get in on the trend while it's going up. It's the worst thing you can do because you're getting the worst entry, but you need the biggest amount of stop, which increases your risk. There's a lot I could talk about, but there's a lot we're going to be covering in the presentation as well. Um, so guys, let, let, us, let us know, where are you from? Are you new to trading? Are you new to cryptos? Um, and I think we'll get started soon, if we're all ready. Yeah, so yeah, we've given people enough time to log in. And obviously we know a lot of people are, are watching on the replay. It's still the summer in the UK. So um, a lot of people are gonna be watching the replay over the next few hours. So with that being said, the plan is guys, if you've got any major questions, keep them till the end i'll be popping back in at the end but until then let andy just give you as much knowledge as possible grab a pad um, and a pen and start taking notes guys because there is going to be a ton of knowledge bombs being dropped um and with that being said mr demi take it away right i'm just gonna switch my video up just to make sure the stream runs smoothly and um as Gavin said, um, if you do have any questions, uh, please leave them until the end and we'll do our best to answer all of them. So, um, can you confirm that you can see my screen? Hopefully, everybody can see my screen. Um, Okie dokie. So, today I'm going to be sharing with you basically how I turned. $30,000 into $180,000 in just three months. And I'm going to be sharing with you my secrets that I've learned on the trading floors of major hedge funds and how you can learn how to 5x, 10x, or even 100x your investments in cryptocurrencies. 
I believe that this is one of the most unique opportunities that we might ever experience in our lifetime. And I really want to share what my knowledge is of the financial markets in general, so my background, and also what I believe right now is an amazing opportunity to learn a skill that is, is still relatively untapped. So it's an asset class that's still relatively untapped, and that's what's exciting about getting involved right now. So let's get going, guys. So you're going to discover my exact system that I've used to grow my account by 600% in three months. The account actually did get even better, which I'm going to share with you a little bit later. You're going to understand the exact criteria that I use to uncover hidden gems that are about to explode higher. I still use exactly this methodology today. You're going to find out how to develop your edge and apply the right strategy at the right time to maximize your returns. So for those that don't know who I am, I want to share with you why you should listen to me. So I've traded the markets for over a decade for some of the biggest banks and hedge funds in London, including JP Morgan Traders and Barcap. I've previously managed a $200 million account for a hedge fund in London. I am regularly interviewed on British television, financial programs, and also at investor shows for my views on the markets. I lecture at Middlesex University in London for their degree in finance. And you can actually find the London Trade Institute on their website as one of their partners. I'm also the co-founder of the London Trading Institute. Now, before we dive into the presentation, I just want to share with you that I'm no particular genius. In fact, the honest truth is I did struggle at trading for years before I finally found success. Back then, I didn't understand the blueprint that I needed to succeed. I was kind of shooting in the dark and I had no set plan. I was struggling to make consistent profit. So I understood a lot. I, I learned a lot. And, and back then when I started, we didn't have YouTube. We didn't have all these tools that we have today. But in my opinion, what I was actually struggling with is, is to have a, a set strategic plan with set rules that I could follow. I was kind of overwhelmed with too much information. So it basically meant I was inconsistent. So I got my lucky break in 2004. So a very, very long time ago where I got a position on the trading floors in London. And this is actually me looking much, much younger than what I am today. Um, and this is in the city building for those that are in London in Moorgate. So this was my first trading position. I got my mentor who taught me the inside the secrets of trading like a bank. So early on, I was really fortunate. You see, if, you read a, if you've read textbooks or gone on YouTube, most likely it is you've probably learned how to trade like a retail trader. But unfortunately, most retail traders lose money. So you want to be trading more like the banks. And I got to learn exactly how to do that from an early age. So from here, I went on to make my first six-figure trade in FX, making over $123,380, which was a huge amount of money for me at that time. Now, this was for a company, just to be kind of transparent. This was not going in my pocket. Um, and then I experienced my first seven-figure day, netting just over $1.5 million, which again was mind-blowing for me. I couldn't believe what was possible by trading um, this, these markets. And everything was almost perfect, and I was having the time of my life, but there was just one problem. I was working 15 hours a day, and my brain never stopped thinking about the markets. And this didn't really fit with the lifestyle that I wanted. So I wanted to make a lot of money, but I also wanted a lifestyle, you know, time to enjoy it. So I wanted to try something new. And the reality is it was tiring, exhausting, and just not sustainable. So I decided I left the city trading floors with all the money I'd saved. Okay, so for all my, my, my commissions I was getting for my trading, I put it all into a trading account and I was ready to take on the world and go it alone. And in my first two months, it was great. It was absolutely great. Okay, I wasn't trading the same kind of size that I was trading with the institutions. I was trading my own personal money that I'd saved. And 
you know, and, and by the way, just to, you might be thinking, how, how did I save so much money? Well, I was living at home. Um, I didn't have any real expenses and I was earning a lot of money from the city. And that's kind of how I did it. So I funded my account with 250K. I went to 400K. So I grew the account to 400K within two months. And I was like, wow, I am in cloud nine right now. And I thought, wow, I'm going to turn this into a million. I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to be rich. And I was like excited, like a kid, naive, let's say. And that's when it kind of completely fell apart. I got greedy. I got overconfident. So I know some of you guys might resonate with this. And I basically blew the lot. I blew everything. And I was literally distraught. Um, and I knew that I had a decision to make, you know, am I, am I going to go back to the city? Am I going to, I'm, I'm going to be shamed. Am I going to quit this industry and just do something else? I'm not made for it. It was just like, all these things were going through my head. I had a lot of explaining to do to, um, to my spouse about what had happened. Anyway, it was, I was at complete rock bottom. Now for most people, you know, the, the reality is, is that, it, you would want to quit, right? You would want to quit. And I was no different. And if you ask enough professional traders who are successful, you'll find that most of them have gone through some kind of disaster like this. Now, I'm not saying, guys, that you need to go through a disaster like this. In fact, I'm not recommending it. Um, it doesn't feel good. But I'll be honest, if I didn't go through it, I think I was meant to go through it personally, because I maybe was young, naive, with an ego, thinking that I could just do what I wanted and I had control. But actually, the market taught me a big lesson. And it taught me about the importance of discipline. Discipline is everything. And so now, if you ask me and you see how I trade, you'll never hear me thinking about just the, how much money am I going to make. It's always like, how much money am I willing to lose? Really, are you really willing to lose that amount? Don't just go with a big position because you're so sure about the trade. And it really has changed something fundamentally inside me, that experience that I now pass on to you guys. And, I, and this is what I continuously tell my students. So from greed to overconfidence, the reality is over the years, I've made more mistakes than most traders will ever read about. But it's these bad times that definitely have made me a much better trader and also a much better mentor right now. So having a mentor I could go to probably saved my career as a trader because I was ready to give it all up. He helped me learn from my mistakes and taught me how to have the right mindset and discipline to make consistent profits over the long term. Fast forward a few years after this big setback, I was headhunted for a position to manage a $200 million trading account and a team of pro traders for a hedge fund in London. I couldn't believe my luck, but also I was like absolutely scared. You can say the next word, but I was, I was very fearful of taking on this on, but I knew I had no choice. I had to say yes and just deal with it. So <laughs> I knew at this point I'd made it back. And, you know, getting this position, I was kind of like, well, I'm going to stay on the institutional path. Yes, I have to work a lot of hours, but just enjoy it, make money and just have a career, have a long term career, stay in the city. That's kind of what I, I said to myself. And then one day I was asked to teach some of the struggling junior traders who um, who weren't making money and wanted to improve. And I needed to focus on basically I was asked to focus on what it is that they were doing wrong and basically sit and observe what they were doing. And, you know, the, the reality is initially I was very resistant to it. I was like, you know, I need to make my own money. I've got family to feed. I don't really need this, but you know, I, I kind of thought, well, when I needed help, I had my mentor and I felt like it was my duty to pay it forward. And so I agreed to do it. And over the following months, the joy I got from helping the juniors make money uncovered my passion for coaching. And this is the reason that I decided to set up the London Trading Institute to teach people the right approach, you know, without the hype, without all the BS, but actually teaching you real things that you need to learn and develop 
not just in technique, but also as a person to be able to successfully make a living and more than a living from financial trading. Now, if you fast forward to today and because of trading, I can honestly say to you that I have an amazing lifestyle, an amazing life. Because not only it's not about the financial gains anymore, I also have the time to enjoy my, you know, the wealth that I build through trading. I live in my dream house. I drive my dream car. I travel the world with my family. Okay. Um, I've been to most places around the world. Um, I got to marry my soulmate. This lady actually was the, what pushed me into trading about 18 years ago when I had zero money. And, um, you know, she basically bought me a course um, and, and almost forced me to get into trading. She kind of said, well, I think you'll be really good at this. I think you should do it. So that's kind of literally what happened. And um, I put here, I've got two beautiful daughters, but I need to update this slide because now I've just had a baby uh, a few days ago. So I now have three beautiful daughters and um, I get to contribute and make a difference to those that need it the most. And I've got my time back. That's the most important thing for me. It's about now having that time to enjoy uh, the time that I am with my family. And then also I love what I do. I love coaching. I love trading. And it's just building a life that's on your terms, not on somebody else's terms. And you can absolutely do this in a very short period of time, a lot shorter than what you believe is possible. Now, for the rest of the presentation, guys, I'm going to be focusing and sharing with you the crypto opportunity that is available to you. I believe, sincerely believe that correctly trading and investing cryptocurrencies has the power to create enough wealth, not just for you and your family, but for generations to come. That's how big I think. I think this is bigger than the internet. I think it's 10x the internet. So that kind of gives you an idea of how much I believe in this space. Today, I'm going to share with you the crypto formula that I've discovered to make big returns whilst keeping risk at a minimum. Now, crypto is not like effects, stocks or commodities. So before I could teach crypto trading, I needed to prove my methods could work. So to make it interesting, I set myself a challenge to hit 100k profit in three months, starting with just $30,000. Now, I... You know, I believe that, you know, steadily growing an account is the way forward. But there's a lot, there's so much volatility in cryptos that normally, like, you know, when I take a trade in FX, I might go, I might end up with a two to one trade, right? A reward to risk of two to one. Often the same type, type of trade with the same type of risk, I could end up with a 10 to one with cryptos. That's why you can grow the account fast. Now, right now, the markets are going sideways, but at some point, when they start to explode higher again, there's going to be so much opportunity to really, again, do something similar to what I've done. So in three months, I grew 30K to 180K. And since then, um, I've basically grown it to 279K. Okay, And what I've basically done is I've utilized margin and then invested it into spot for the long term. So that's what I recommend. So use the futures, use the margin where you can basically leverage, okay, borrow by borrowing. I'm going to show you how to do that. And then with the money that you make, you put it into spot and then you store it. And that's basically what I've been doing. And so now I continue to do that. I, I make money on my futures account and then I put it into long term investments. Okay, I'm not going out with it, I'm not spending it on anything. I'm literally just continuously accumulating and accumulating because these projects, once they become mainstream, they could be worth a hundred X more easily. Okay. Cause these, they, these is just, this is just the beginning as I was saying before. Now what's crazy about all of this is that I've done this, you know, risking no more than 2% per trade. Okay. That's my rule. And, and I often don't even use the 2%. Normally it's half or 1%, but I allow myself to take up to 2% per trade trading just one to two hours per day. And despite the recent correction in the market, I was still able to grow my account by using hedging, adding protection and shorting my banking money on the way down. In fact, I was short Bitcoin from about 58,000 before the big drop to 30K. I took profit around the 40K mark. And I was actually anticipating at that time that 40K 
would be a good buying point. But as you saw, the market went down to about 29. Okay, and that's been the low so far. Now, you might be wondering, can this work for me if I'm a complete beginner with no experience whatsoever? 100% yes, 100% yes. So I know some of you guys have already said that you're complete beginners. It absolutely can work for you. The amazing thing is that my process is scalable and repeatable and can be modeled. That's the key thing. You need to be able to model what I do, not copy model. Very important. There's a big distinction there because you cannot be me and I cannot be someone else, but you can take the core rules and principles and then make them your own. That's, that's the, the key to success. Another thing you might be wondering is how much money do you need to get started? Well, now we've got a lot of successful students and some of them have started with as little as $500. Now, of course, you're not going to turn $500 into a million overnight, right? Okay, or even 100K overnight, but it's enough to get you started. And, you know, as you'll see in a minute, you know, with $500, you can do amazing things with, within cryptos. So like Busy Housewife and novice trader Eleanor, who doubled her $500 account in the first 14 days. And you can kind of see some more screenshots since then, uh, where she's taken some trades, 123% on one, which is Harmony, 50% on Zill, 30% on ICX, total profit of £797. Okay, so Eleanor since has funded her account with more with more funds than 500, but she started off with 500 just to kind of get comfortable. And she said, I've paid a fortune in university fees that didn't deliver half of the content that this program provided and his experience is top notch. And I don't think that there's anyone better to be delivering this course. This is the opportunity of a lifetime. And my goal now is to provide financial freedom for my family. Or like fellow newbie and ex-military man, Tony, who had turned $500 into almost 4,000 in two months. And um, he actually went on to grow that even further um, uh, in the following months. I think he was up to about 7K. So you'll find Tony in our group. And um, or like Total Beginner Shaddy, who set a target that he achieved way earlier than expected. So he made a profit of $20,766.40 in his first month. He started with a 10K account. So he didn't start with 500, he started with 10K, but still amazing profits, you know, at a very early stage. Now, today we're going to learn the four secrets that I've used to make 600% ROI in just three months that my students have also used to get similar results. And at the end, I'm also, if you stay until the end, if you are here live, that's the most important thing. If you're here live and stay until the end, I'm going to send you a video of one of my long-term crypto investments that I believe has the potential to 100x over the next well, I don't want to give you a timeline, but let's say um, in the next one to two years, I believe it can easily 100x. So I will get that video sent over to you by just staying until the end of the presentation. That's my gift to you. So here are the th four things we're going to cover, okay, in the next sort of 20, 25 minutes. We're going to talk about market timing. We're going to talk about borrowing. We're going to talk about portfolio management, and we're going to talk about how to value a coin. So let's start guys, because we have a lot to get through. So how do we use charting tools to identify buy and sell points in the market? Well, I have a rule of three, okay? I have a rule of three and it's basically a rule that is quite simple. I need to have at least three valid reasons. Very important that they're valid, not made up. They, these are written on paper in a plan three valid reasons why I should take a trade. Otherwise, I can't take the trade. So what we are doing is we are building a wall of confluence. So that's what you want to do. So it's like if you have one reason, it's paper thin. A second reason is a little bit stronger. A third reason, it's building now into a strong wall. Fourth or fifth or sixth, that's even better. Okay, it's going to be hard. It's going to be much higher probability if you have more and more reasons okay and we are going to identify turning points in the market using this now you have a minimum of three reasons of where to buy and sell now this is the this is really fundamental 
you need to avoid FOMO because it's really, really tempting to jump into the market. So FOMO, for those that are new, is the fear of missing out. It's tempting to jump in, right? By, by using the correct tools and a systematic approach, you can grow your account consistently and, and over the long term. Look, I'll tell you something. I was, um, you know, as I said at the beginning of this presentation, you know, I'm probably winning nine days out of 10. So like, but I, every now and I'll take a loss. And um, I took a, a trade when Bitcoin the other day, if you've been following Bitcoin, it's now kind of around 40K, but it was just starting to push up and it got to about 34 and a half. And I thought to myself, what, well, there's a massive resistance at 35. I think we're going to pull back now to 32 and a half. So I took a trade and I put my stop at quite a conservative stop. So I didn't go with a massive position and, and I put it above 36 and it, you know, I woke up and it just blew through it. Right. And I, and I took a loss. And I got up and I looked at the charts. And I was like, oh, man, that's a big move. Didn't expect that. And the first thing that I, I wanted to do is I wanted to jump in. It's just natural human tendency. But I looked at the markets and I was like, well, this is like there's no edge here. There's no edge. There's no information telling me that I'm more probable to take a winning trade than a losing trade. So I'm just going to be gambling here. So I'm, I'm going to wait. So what I did instead was I spent some time, I analyzed the chart, and then I set my alert points, my key points of interest, which is the kind of things I'm going to show you today. And then I waited, I waited, I waited, and literally the worst possible time, and I got my alert at eight o'clock where I had guests round, where I had like um, the kids ready to get to bed. And I thought, Mike, I've waited all day for this, and now I get the alert. So I literally, I told Gavin the other day, I literally ran upstairs into my office. I looked at my charts like, brilliant. That's the price I'm getting in. But I already planned the trade. I put, took the trade, put the stop, put the target. And then I went off to deal with the kids. And literally I came back and the market collapsed. You know, I posted it in our group. You can see if you're a part of the crypto and FX trade, the market collapsed. And it pretty much went straight to my target. And I made just over 1K on that trade. But it literally, like, if I didn't, and I was like, if I didn't take that trade, I would have been really annoyed. But that's kind of like, this is what I'm saying. So you need to avoid FOMO. You need to follow your plan, follow your rules. And timing is critical because if I just jumped in, I would have ended up being stopped out. But because I waited on that trade, I got in at the right price and I ended up catching the whole move. Now, the, I'm not going to get into all of these things here. We don't have enough time, but this is basically a summary of all of the tools that I use in my trading. I'm going to show you how to use some of these tools right now using a case study that I've built for you guys. So the case study is on Cardano. So this is a real trade that I took and I built it up before. I posted it in our group and then I, we waited for the price to come down. So I'm going to show you how to do this so that you can go away and start to think. So for those guys that already have some skills in trading, you might want to go and start looking at replicating some of these things. Now, I'm going to show you basically how to build a wall of confidence part by part. So remember, we need at least three reasons, guys. So let's start. So here is Cardano, okay? ADA, Cardano, okay? One of the most popular cryptocurrencies. And we have a market here that is trending upwards. And so what do I do? I plot my custom moving average to this market and I identify that the last time we came down, the market acted as support. So you can see here, the market acted as support. So it's reasonable to, to believe that it might act as support again. So that is one of the reasons that we could use on this chart for potentially finding a buy zone. Now I've just added another tool, my super trend. And this interestingly is also at a similar price point. So it's not exact. And by the way, we're just building blocks here. Okay. We're not finding exact entries right now. We're just building evidence. And there's another reason there. This could be a support area. Let's carry on. Then I draw a horizontal line where we find the last resistance point. 
So the markets love to find past resistance that become future support. So the market loves these kind of levels that haven't been acted as support yet. So there's a third reason. Let's carry on. Then I've just drawn in my up trend line. So I've connected these points here and we have an up trend line. Again, at a very similar point. Can you get the picture now? How many things have we got? Up trend, uh, the custom moving average, the super trend, the, the trend line up, right? The horizontal line, that's five. So we now have a buy zone. This is a buy zone. Now, most people would be jumping in here. Most people would be jumping in. And sometimes this happens. Not going to lie. I'm not going to say, oh, every time it doesn't go like that. It, sometimes this happens, especially if the market's kind of a runaway market and everything's going up. Most people are getting lucky and they're just buying randomly and it's just going up. However, if you want to make serious money from doing this, here's what you need to do. You need to wait for your buy zone. So the way, what you say to yourself is, it either goes to my buy zone, right? Or I don't take the trade. Now, if you invest in this, it's different. As an investor, you could buy some here, you could buy some here, you could buy some here, here, a bit lower, a bit higher. You're averaging in, right? It's a different, it's a completely different thing. Because if you believe Cardano is going to be $10, $20 in the future, well, does it really matter if you put some at 170, some at one, some at one, two, some at, you know, in the grand scheme of things, no. But as a trader, we have to time the market. And the thing is, as traders, we can make a lot of money very quickly. So you don't need to, you don't need it to go to $10. You just need to get in at the right price. Hopefully that's making sense to you guys. So here's what happened, everybody. This is the plan. I was expecting, so I've drawn my Fibonacci. It's come back into my red zone. So the target was going to be up here somewhere. And this is what happened. The market spiked down. It went straight into our buy zone. And it actually went even higher than what I was expecting. It got to 67% within 24 hours. 67% within 24 hours. Now, you probably can't even appreciate how big that move is because it's not just, say if you invested in it, that's one thing, you make 67%. As a trader, you can use leverage, you can use a stop. You could have made probably three, four, 500% within 24 hours on that trade easily. And even more, even a thousand percent, depending on where you place your stop. So you can see like a stop below here would have been enough. So you could have been risking this much and you could have made this much. Now, that's the perfect scenario. And even if you got out there, it's still a massive, you know, there's, there's at least a 5x there. Hopefully, this is kind of resonating and making sense. So if you use the right tools, you're much more likely to grow your account consistently. And you must be patient. You must wait for the key levels to, be, to come into play before you take the trade, okay? So following a set of rules creates structure and a base for consistent profits. Now, it's critical that you use the correct tools with the correct strategy to maximize your profit potential and avoid hype, FOMO, and stress when trading. If you're stressed out, if you don't know when you should get in and when you should not get in, you are not trading the right way. You are not trading with rules. You're not trading with consistency and you're not going to make consistent money. You're probably going to be like what I was at the beginning, um, basically inconsistent. Now, this is another type of trade here. This is a momentum trade, something I posted in our, in our private group um, where I was basically, literally, it was about to go. I got the turning point. I had a, you know, these are the things that I had here. Um, various we use different tools for different types of trades and everything was ready to go so i literally got in so with these kind of momentum trades you've got to get in at market and pretty much straight after that post the market ran up um super super fast so we had five reasons there it was up 30 percent. you can see at that time i was super excited with that 
Um, but, you know, unless you know how to do it, sometimes with these momentum trades, you're not going to have time. But for those that don't have time, you're going to be able to use some of the swing trading strategies where you don't have to be in front of your screens. Now, what's really, really key here, guys, especially in the current market, is you need to also be short the market. So in other words, you need to make money by selling the market because it's not always going to be going up. So this is an example where I had some technical reasons why I should go short Ripple XRP at 134.60. Now, I'm going to show you some examples of like how, been, how I was buying this at much cheaper rates. But right now, I had an opportunity to sell it. So there's no emotion. Even though I was invested in this for the, for the long term up, I was looking to make money on the downside. So we got to 134.60. And on this occasion, I was marrying my technicals with order flow. So the order flow is basically a big part of my secret source. And what I identified was, was that whales were selling at 135. So I jumped in just in front of them for an easy move down. So here's this, a screenshot of what I was looking at. And what this basically shows us is there was a huge amount of orders at 135. So basically confirming, right, that there was, you know, that the, the supply was matching the technicals. And that really confirmed I could get in at a really good price and I can go in with a tight stop because I knew I had all this protection. So basically, this market couldn't go any higher until these orders were taken up. And there was about 2.25 million there. So it was good. I knew it was going to be hard for this wall to break. So I ended up taking the trade and then I watched it. And, you know, what I was looking for is to see if it got, if it was going to break and it didn't break and the market basically went down. Now, here's, you know, for people that think, God, I, I need to have a lot of money. Look at my risk here, guys. I was risking $141 because I went with a really, really tight stop. And I had a goal, a realistic goal of making just over a thousand dollars. So question to you guys, who would be happy to risk $141 to make over a thousand? I would assume all of you would, right? So this is the key. It's low risk, high reward. So here's what happened, guys. The market held perfectly and it went down as predicted. Now, what I love about these types of trades, and again, if you are part of our crypto group, you'll see this all the time. My type, my favorite type of trades, they go instantly into profit. In fact, I'm going to post one of my trades that I took today. I'll post it tomorrow morning. So if you're in our group, you'll see it. Um, and you'll see exactly, you know, this one I made, uh, the one today, I made about $700 on it. Um, it was two trades, one on BTC and one on ETH. But the key thing with it is it's instant profits. When it's not instant, I almost know it's not going to work. So I just close the trade immediately, normally. So normally my trades go immediately. And this is no different. So here in five minutes, I was up $262 in five minutes. And then in about two hours, I was up $820. And to be honest, you can actually see the time there. So you can see I'm not making it up. It was eight past 10. And I normally go to bed about half nine. I like to unwind about half nine. And it was already past my bedtime. And I'm thinking, I've got $180, $200 to go. Am I going to seriously sit up and wait for this now for $200? My sleep is worth more. So I closed it. Um, I wasn't willing to let the market go back all the way. Now, what you can also do is you can, you can manage it. You control your stop. You can do all those kind of things. But... I was happy with that. Look, I risked 141 and I made 820. So I closed the trade. It did, in fact, go down lower. And if I'd stayed in it, I would have made the, the initial target of $1,041. So by using the right tools, you are able to get quick profits with low risk. OK, so today's trade, I was risking $250 on each trade. Um, I made $700 in about give or take about 45 minutes. And yesterday, I, something similar, it took about, that. the one the other day was like even quicker, it was like half an hour. So it is critical 
um, you know, basically correctly using the right tools gives you quick profits with low risk. And this is critical to avoid unnecessary drawdown and what the crypto family call weak hands. For me, this really suits my style. I like to make quick profits. Now for others, we'd need to adjust your plan. Maybe you're a bit more patient. Maybe it doesn't suit you, but it's really important that you trade with your personality. And that's a real critical part. Now, guys, um, I'm going to speed things up a little bit. Um, we're going to get into secret number two, which is borrowing to invest. But you must really understand what you're doing in this part. So margin trading. Okay, margin trading allows you to 10x or even 100x your investment when done correctly. Would you borrow money at 5% interest if you could make 300% back? Some people really struggle with borrowing. But think of it like this. We all you know, we borrow when we buy a house. Most of us do, right? Even if you've got the cash, right? I would still borrow because you can use your cash to make a lot more money than, than two, three, four percent that you're going to pay. So I'll give you an example of um, a live case study of Bitcoin, of how it can be very different when you invest with margin. Now, I want to stress, it's important that you do this at the right time okay so you need to get you need to be sure that the market you had you know you need to get those confirmations that the market is trending up before you do this but i want to give you some insights as to what difference it can make so that you can learn from it so let's have a look at this so if we take an example here of bitcoin if you had ten thousand dollars to invest and wanted to buy bitcoin at forty thousand you'd receive 0.25 bitcoin right a quarter of a bitcoin and if you had a target of 100K, you'd basically be looking to make about 15K, which is not bad, right? So you invest 10, you're looking to make 15. And that's absolutely fine. Now, what if you used your 10K to borrow 3X your capital? So you can easily do that with any crypto exchange. You can borrow off your capital. Same work, same trade, but the difference is more profit, right? So you target the 100K, but now you have three times your position size and you potentially make 45K, right? Now, this type of strategy is amazing once the trend is confirmed. And that's really what I was doing a lot of when the trend was up. And then I was investing it and being safe, which is what we recommend that you do. So you don't stay leveraged, you use leverage, make money and put it back into spot, which is safe. So essentially a 10K investment, risk management plus margin, you have a potential 450% instead of 150%. So using margin can be a great way to increase your account fast, but please only do it once you fully understand how to make it work for you. So for your complete beginner and you haven't had any support or mentoring or any education, you want to avoid this until you do, because it can be very dangerous and people over leverage and don't understand the risks and they, and you can lose your capital. Now, a big part of how I've grown my account is this secret number three, which is portfolio management. If you want to grow your account fast and keep your risks small, you need to master portfolio management. So what is portfolio management? Well, it's the process of identifying the best place for your money to work hardest for you right now. Correct capital allocation leads to more profits and less drawdown. It is fundamental to how I've grown my account so fast. And it is the principle of moving funds from one crypto to another crypto, depending on where you feel the opportunity is. So sometimes you get a crypto that has been pumped up, you know, some news has come out and you've been in that trade. And, you're, and, then, you're, and then you hold on and you hold on and you hold on and suddenly it comes all the way back down, right? People probably experienced that if you're in cryptos for sure. What you want to do is you need to understand that actually, hold on a minute, I've had a really big push up. Why don't I take 75% of my profit off? Take that cash and then go invest it somewhere else and just keep a small position just in case it carries on. That is part of portfolio management. So you need to know when to move into cash and when to be long, when to be short. It is really using those skills to identify you know, where your money is going to work hardest for you. Because holding a coin has an opportunity cost. So here's an example. 
for the same period, if you'd invested in ADA, Cardano, it moved up 5% in, in three weeks. And you think, okay, 5% well, in three weeks, you've got to be happy with that. Well, if you'd invested in, in Ripple, XRP, you would have made 147% in the same exact period. So that's what I'm saying. There is an opportunity cost and you must understand, you must understand, you must understand exactly what you are investing in before you do and what the opportunity is. And so this is where like, you know, what, what people are doing is they're investing in everything and they don't realize that they're putting a lot of risk on the table. We want to keep our risk low. And if you keep your risk low, then you have much a much better probability of staying in the game, which is which is what we want to do. We don't want to over risk. Now, this is an example of one of the trades that I took in Ripple. So I was buying Ripple at 52 cents before it exploded higher. OK, and you can see here, these are my orders in Binance. You can see um, 51 cents, 54 cents, 50 cents. So these are the prices I was accumulating at, at that time. And I basically made just over 36 grand in three weeks. And here's the kicker, using none of my own money. How? Well, I actually borrowed the dollars. So I borrowed the money through my exchange and I used it to basically buy Ripple and I paid $57 of interest to do that. So I literally paid $57.58 of interest and I made over 36K. That is the power of leverage. That is the power of borrowing. So I think the answer is obvious, but who would be happy to pay $57 of interest to make over 36K? And that was in three weeks. Okay, so that was a, obviously a big, big push towards my account growing so fast. Now, finally, guys, um, secret number four is how to value a coin. How do you know when a coin is cheap? How do you know if a coin is expensive? Let me show you. So let's go through this. Firstly, don't look at Twitter. Avoid the hype, the FOMO. Don't go onto Facebook groups and start asking randoms who you have no idea if they've got any expertise or knowledge at all. Okay, you're not going to get great tips off these, these kind of um, mediums. Most of them are just like you trying to find out information and they're just pumping their own coins that they've already bought into. So definitely don't trade off tips. Now, a question here. When you look at these two here, we have Stella at $57, sorry, 57 cents. And we have Bitcoin Cash at $666, which is more expensive. Let me know, guys, what you think is more expensive here. And by the way, I'm just looking at the questions um, right now. But I'm not, like I said, guys, Gavin will hopefully um, start collating some of your questions and we'll go back to them. So which one is more expensive? So we've got mixed answers. Most people are saying Bitcoin Cash, right? Actually, it's not. And I'll explain why. It's actually Stella. So well done to Peter for getting that right. And um, whoever else has said uh, Stella. Because the price does not tell us whether something is cheap or expensive. The market cap tells us whether something is cheap or expensive. So it's really, really important that you look at the market cap. That's why Bitcoin is the most expensive. It's number one. Okay, you can go and look at this on, uh, I've forgotten the name of it now, coinmarketcap.com, coinmarketcap.com. And you'll see a list of all the top coins by market cap. And Bitcoin is number one by market cap. 
and I'll explain what that is. Okay, so the price could be whatever, 50 cents or 5 million. It doesn't really matter. The, the, because the market cap is what tells you the potential for growth. And it gives you an apple versus apple comparison. Okay, so let, let's uh, go through what it means. So market cap in cryptos is, essentially, it's the total value of all the coins that have been mined, and it's calculated by multiplying the number of coins in circulation by the current market price of a single coin. So there, with cryptos, basically, there's a certain, so something like Bitcoin, there's only a certain amount, so in this case, 21 million, that can get mined. And once they are all mined, there's no more to mine and they're all in circulation. So, and then it's that, however many are in circulation right now, times the price that will give you the market cap. And that allows you to basically compare cryptos with each other. And the other important thing is circulating supply. Okay, so for those that know basic economics, the supply and the demand, you know, so how many are supplied is going to make a difference to the potential future price. So what does it mean by definition? It is the number of cryptocurrency coins or tokens that are publicly available and circulating in the market. For example, the circulated supply of Bitcoin will gradually increase until the max supply of 21 million coins is reached. Think about this, guys. Bitcoin has a max supply of 21 million. As long as people still want Bitcoin, where is the price going to go? It can only go up, right? If you've got a limited supply and continuous demand, the price can only go up. There's no other way. Unless people decide suddenly they don't want to use Bitcoin anymore and the demand goes, it's, it's just a matter of time that Bitcoin is going up a lot higher. So general rules, low market cap cryptos offer the highest potential for growth. Low supply will in help increase the price. Now, I want to share with you something that is quite interesting. Because cryptos are quite new, I want to share with you something that will kind of hopefully really open your eyes up. So if you guys are already involved in cryptos and you're looking at some coins, this is going to really help you. So cryptos have, you know, th there's different categories of cryptocurrencies, if you're not sure about that. So there's like the decentralized finance, there's non-fungible tokens, there's the stable coins, there's like the currency coins and so on. So what you can do is you can look at each category and you can see who the leaders are. So let's say, for example, here, you have heard about Ecomi and you're, and you're really excited about them. You love their project. You've done your research. You've done all the things that you need to do. And you think it's a good investment and you think, well, you know, it's trading at 0.008 cents. So not even, yeah, I mean, a fraction of a cent. And you're thinking, well, okay, how big can this go? Well, why don't we compare it to the leader? Now, the leader has got a price of $12. So do you think it's going to go from 0.008 to $12? Well, that would just be a little bit insane, right? And it's not the right comparison. What you should be doing is saying, well, hold on a minute. Theta has a market cap of 11.9 billion. Ecomi has 1.13 billion. So this has got the potential for a 10x to just reach the market leader. So we know this is possible. Now, the reality is, is that all of these cryptos are likely to be much, much higher in the future. But this is just giving you an idea. Well, hold on a minute. If, if, if this has got this market cap, then this can definitely get to at least this. So it can give you an immediate idea of without us breaking into new market cap highs, where it could go. Hopefully that, that's kind of making sense. So let's go down a little bit down the, the category. And we find another one here, a long shot, Centric. Now, again, this is just an example. But again, the market cap is tiny of this one. Now, if you compare this to the leader, you've got potential 1,628x. You don't need to invest a lot of money. If Centric 
if, if after doing your research, you think, wow, Centric has got a lot of things going for it. And it's tiny market cap has got a lot of potential. Well, the reality is you could turn $1,000 into 1.628 million just by getting to where the leader is, theta in this case. So that's why you've seen people with really modest amounts of money make a hell of a lot of money because this is such a new space. You just need to know what to look for to find these opportunities. So guys, I hope you can already, yes, it's coin market cap, Andrew, I've just seen your question. Um, so I hope you can already see what is possible and how quickly you can succeed once you understand the blueprint. So mastering these four things gives you a clear path to building sustainable wealth and impact. Now, I don't know where you are in your mind, but I know that we have been trained to believe that you have to work hard, do the hours in order to get remunerated. But it's old school thinking. And this is how I used to think. And look, I believe you should still work hard, but work smart. Okay, you need to work smart. Learn the skills and then find a system. So the way I'm trading right now, I'm not spending 15 hours a day. I'm doing my analysis for two, three hours a week, and then I'm waiting for those alerts, okay? And when the alerts come, I'm on my desk to take the trade, and that's it, okay? And that's all you need to do. So it's really a small amount of time. All successful people understand that the quickest way to success is to follow a proven blueprint and to leverage other people's knowledge, which is why I created the three-month crypto training program, which I'd like to share with you if it might be of interest to you. Okay, and remember, if you stay until the end, and even if this is not for you, um, you can you you may you may come back to it. It may be for you in the future, but I will be sending you that video of one of my crypto investments. So, what is this course aiming to do? It's going to show you how to reach your goals and how to accelerate and amplify your current income. It's as simple as that. If you want to build this out hands-on together, we are positive we can help you get the results you want quickly. So here's some feedback from some of our students. In my first month of trading cryptos, I started with $10,000 and I've already doubled my account to just over $20,000. Most of it has come purely from what you've shown us in the program of how to identify undervalued coins that are likely to go up in value. So I bought them at spot. Now I'm looking to implement the margin strategies that you teach us because I've done this during my, if I had done this during my first month, then I could have been up an extra three to five X the amount that I've already made with no extra work required. This was Afi Hussain. Um, John Slack, I'm currently in my second month in the program and I'm happy to say that all the hard work is paying off as yesterday I made $8,058.48 profit in one day. Uh, Julie here says, thank you Andy Demi. I've I have to admit that my confidence in training started to improve as soon as I started sharing my ideas and practicing more. I've now moved from making losses to making 17% in profit in the last few days. Looking forward to many more days like these. Um, Lorian White said, I just had a rather big moment. I set the goal of earning my first $500 within two weeks. Well, I smashed that target and ended up tripling my account within the first two weeks, all with $30 risk per trade and whilst working a full-time job. Amazing job from Laurie. To be honest, when I first heard about Andy, I was unsure, maybe because of the fact that there's a lot of scammers out there. But then I watched the videos, I joined the group, it's not that expensive, and slowly started to have confidence. In two weeks, I'm up £2,000 by Neil D. Now, most of the times, the things that stop us is fear. The false evidence appearing real. The reality is, guys, I've shared with you a lot of information here that you can go away and use. And you have a choice. Okay, you are free to choose. I've basically done, I believe I've done what I've said I'm going to do. And I've delivered what I've promised. And now you have to decide whether you want our help to build this step by step, or whether you want to go it alone and try and figure it out all on your own. So essentially, the slower, harder way, spending hours with trial and error, wasting time and money to try and find a formula that works, or the easier, faster way, with a proven roadmap to follow from someone who's been where you want to go and offers the smartest and quickest way to succeed. Now, we can greatly accelerate your learning curve to start getting results like many of our students have. 
The reality is, guys, this is not a get rich quick scheme. Okay, you will have to learn a set of skills, but with these skills, especially in this asset class, and especially right now, this has the potential to get this for you so fast, where you have more time with your family, more money, more freedom to do what you want, when you want. So guys, if I may take five to 10 minutes to share with you the Crypto Like a Pro trading system, if you are happy to listen through, please stay on. Of course, if this is not for you, or if you're already on the program, please feel free to, um, you know, to leave um, in, in as nice a way as possible. But if this might be of interest to you, I'd like to take five to 10 minutes, guys, just to share with you this opportunity. And then you can make that decision, like if, if it's right for you or not. Okay, guys, so I'm assuming whoever's staying on wants to hear the opportunity and I will, um, you know, and at the end, guys, we will take your questions, whatever questions you've asked and whatever questions you've got, you know, so stay on just to even have your questions answered. So let's, let's go through and show you what you get with this. So the Crypto Locker Pro trading system. So here's what you get. You will get a mixture of live and online based training to help you get an edge in trading cryptos. You'll see how I professionally manage my crypto portfolio to maximize long and short term returns. You will learn how to spot key buy and sell zones so that you can catch turning points before everybody else. You will find out my exact methodology for tracking and trading over 50 crypto coins, spending less than one hour a day screen time. You will discover my momentum strategy to trade cryptos that are ready to rip higher or lower. You will identify my trade and risk management strategy using volume profile and VWAP to maximize ROI. Each fortnight, you'll get live coaching and group mentoring to accelerate your learning. You'll also get live monthly analysis for me to show you what we should be expecting from the markets and what trade setups that I'll be using. These are amazing. Like people get great results just from these monthly analysis um, sessions that we do. Okay, so they they're very, very popular and very, very um, useful um, to put the, the theory into practice. Now, you're also going to get some of my trade ideas and support um, via our exclusive Crypto Traders Club, which will be run privately on Facebook. So here's a breakdown, a summary of all the things you get on the program. So you're going to learn how to identify hot opportunity signals to get in before the crowd, money and risk management, um, a key, key component. You're going to learn the three different strategy phases, so momentum, reversal, consolidation, how to manage your portfolio to make the most of the compound effect, how to use leverage to correctly leverage correctly to get rapid account growth, mean reversion strategies, the best crypto indicated combinations, and multiple time frame analysis, how to use order flow to identify key areas of demand and supply to get the best entries and stop placements, how you can spend less time in front of the screen and never overpay for a coin, how to swing trade to catch big moves with less screen time, less than 60 minutes needed. How to day trade to be able to catch more moves in both up and down markets. So you'll get three hours of live market analysis with me. Apply in real time what you're learning throughout the Crypto Like a Pro system. So this runs on a Saturday between 12 and 3 p.m. every month and British standard time. So if you're based somewhere else in the world, um, if the hours are really, really crazy, uh, we still get people waking up at two or three or four in the morning, but um, you will get the recording immediately after if you can't wake up for it, if you are based somewhere else or if you can't make it. Um, and basically what we're doing here is we are hunting for trading opportunities and we are setting up the month. So what do we think is going to happen next on Bitcoin this month? Where are the opportunities? And then we also go in and look for trades to take in the session. So the weekly, uh, the fortnightly Q&A support. So you join us on Thursdays where you will get a live session between 12 and 1 p.m. to answer any technical questions that you have. OK, as long as, as well as the trading support that you get anyway. So you get the support in the group, but this is more like um, coaching, right? So if you're struggling with something, you didn't understand a particular topic or subject, 
this is what this is for. And we go through and you get to listen to other people's questions as well. And it's great, it's interactive. You also get all the online recordings of all the live training from the Crypto Like a Pro. So now you can get go back through any part of the Crypto Like a Pro training system whenever you like in order to keep increasing your knowledge and solidifying all the skills that you have learned during your training. You'll get three months VIP group membership. This is where I post some of my crypto trades and market analysis in this private group of students. He will also continue to learn and share your results as you continue to implement the program. You'll get my trade tracker sheet. So you'll need to be organized. You need to keep track of your trades while you're entering your trades. So you'll get my sheet that I've created specifically for cryptos of basically how I manage them and, and how I learn from my trades. During the three months VIP group membership, not only will I personally show you how I fish, but I will also teach you how to fish for yourself. This is important um, and critical really for your long-term success. This is why I'm limiting the number of people who can sign up to a maximum of 50 on this intake. Okay, so that you get the service and attention that you need because you're gonna need support and you're gonna need help, especially um, if you're a beginner, okay? So it's gonna be a, a learning curve. You're also gonna get this beginner bonus. So if you are a beginner and you're thinking, wow, this stuff sounds really advanced. I don't know if I can understand it. The truth is, some of this stuff is advanced, but you should be happy about that. You should be happy about that because we don't want to, we don't want to give you a basic program and then say to you, hey, you're going to need to do a more advanced program. Instead, we have given you a beginner bonus section where we will go through some of the core things that you need to know, like how to set up your charts, the, the brokers, you know, the basics like trend lines, support resistance indicators, chart patterns to ensure that you're ready to hit the ground. Now, if you're intermediate advanced and you're looking to do the program, you won't need to do this section. OK, it's in the bonus section. It's really more for beginners. But of course, you're more than welcome to kind of refresh what you know. In addition, anyone taking action in the next 48 hours is going to get my top crypto hot list. So these are the cryptos that I'm invested in. And that I believe in, and I accumulate over time, and I keep accumulating now. I've done tremendous amount of research, and you're just going to get it all within this document uh, given to you for anybody taking action within 48 hours. And we are strict on that. So this is everything, guys. You will get my complete trading system, a value of eight thousand two hundred seventy-six pounds for just one two nine seven pounds. Okay. That's it. Now, if you are a little bit tight for cash, you can also take on a payment plan. So the payment plan consists of three times four, nine, seven pounds. OK, so you end up paying a little bit more. But if that kind of gets you over the line, then you have that option as well. Of course, if you have the funds and this is something you're interested in, then you can pay the full amount. And you also get a 14 day money back guarantee. So this is a true money back guarantee. If for any reason in the 14 days, even after using the program, even after doing any of the coaching, if you're not happy, you tell, let us know. We refund your money. There's nobody to convince you to stay on. We only want, we're happy to answer any of your questions, any of your queries. But if it's not for you, it's not for you. And that's absolutely fine. You'll get a refund pretty much the same day. So we're also because we you are here with us today you are here live and if you watch this on the recording within the next 48 hours as of when this completes you also have access to this you get the three hours extra live trading analysis and two extra live fortnightly q a sessions included in your program so this is only if you act in the next 48 hours we're going to add so essentially you're now getting six hours um, of live trading analysis and most people can make back that course fee easily within that time if you follow what I'm what I'm doing and then you get two extra coaching sessions as well these are the next times for the coaching sessions guys um, if you can't make them speak to a representative somebody can possibly put you on to the next one but you will get recordings anyway so you've got the 25th of September the 30th of October as your next live trading analysis and then the four 
coaching sessions on the 8th of September, 22nd of September, 6th of October, and the 20th of October. Okay, so you might want to screenshot that, guys, um, if you want to remember dates, or just reach back out to us and we'll send you those dates. Okay, but like I said, don't worry too much about the dates. If you can't make one of the sessions, we can move you on to another session. So guys, that is a total true value of $10,776 from just 1297. Um, there'll be a link being posted right now, if it's not already posted in the group, so you can take advantage. So if you are ready to join, um, this price, by the way, will be going up very, very soon. So this is this is this price you some people might be thinking oh i'm sure i can get it in a in a month or two months it's going to be highly unlikely um the amount that we support and the amount of investment that we make to deliver what we deliver we simply can't maintain it at this level um at this investment level we have priced it as low as we possibly can to help people that maybe are not in that financial business position. But obviously, we are a, a, a company, we have our own costs. So we have to charge for our services. But we always have in mind that we want to 5x or 10x your investment. Of course, we can't guarantee that. But if you follow what we do, what we show you, you can absolutely achieve your um, a return on that investment very, very fast. Now, here's some more results from some of the other crypto students. So, guys, there should hopefully be a, a link in the, in the description. Um, just go to that page if you're ready to sign up. And remember, there's a 14-day back guarantee if you do change your uh, mind or if it's not right for you. So, Fred Martin took the trade on Chili's, was a bit conservative on my take profit, so didn't reach my full potential of what could have been made have now made back the cost of the course in my first week of crypto trading. Awesome. Graham Lancaster-Smith took the plunge last night and entered my first live crypto trades, long and near and light. 13 hours later, just banked $3,798, got to less than nine, and that's the course paid for. We'll share my setup later, but back to my day job for now. Thank you, Andy, Dan, and the rest of the team. Julie, crypto course will be fully paid in a bit. Um, Take profit, hit boom, four, six, seven dollars bag, ching. Now, here's some, here's me with some of my students when we were uh, based in our London office, uh, running our three month program um, in the city. So, this is to also give you an idea of what people are now achieving from our lessons and our teachings. And you can also check us out on Trustpilot, guys. I think you'll be pretty impressed with the reviews that we have which is a rarity in this industry. So here's what Rob had to say. I risked that paid off. I took a three month in-house course with Andy in April, 2019. I took a massive risk by leaving my job and investing a lot of money. A year down the line, I now have multiple streams of income, flexibility to trade whenever I want and the knowledge to and practice to only need to spend 20 to 30 minutes a day on the charts. Andy's course gave me all the tools and knowledge I needed to succeed. And that combined with the endless hours I spent reviewing the charts and trading demo accounts, I'm pleased to be able to share that I'm trading multiple five-figure accounts. Have increased my income significantly, had a five-figure month in December, perfectly in time for Christmas. And I'm now on my way to trading six-figure accounts and I'm going full-time. And I've Andy to thank for it all. And he's doing incredibly well. Um, uh, Rob, even now I've been speaking to him and he's even surpassed what he posted here. Some more here, guys. Saulo Rodriguez, trading with the RTR rules has finally allowed me to get profitable after so many years of trying by myself. Thomas Hole, and the Trading Institute provides the perfect framework for aspiring traders, teaching you real actionable strategies. After doing the career course, I have gone on to become a full-time trader. Tom came from the army. Salo came from Brazil to learn directly with me. Results guaranteed. Join me today. And if you go through my training and don't believe that you can stay committed to learning and applying these training techniques, then simply let me know within 14 days of purchase and I will return 100% of your investment. No questions asked. I promise this course works if you will. So guys, this is your decision now. You can go back to life as usual or you can make this a defining moment. This is everything you get. A reminder, total value of $10,776 for just 1297. This really 
we cannot keep it at this price point. It is a steal. And honestly, most of you guys will probably make that back very, very quickly, probably on your first live trading session with me um, is what our experience has been from other students. So I'm happy now to take questions. Um, I'm not, I haven't been looking at any questions, so I don't know if anybody has been asking. Um, Gavin will hopefully guide me on that. I will turn on my video and uh, sorry about the uh, false start with the presentation. I um, wasn't aware that the screen was not showing. And it's got dark. Cool. <laughs> it has got dark and it's got light over this side of the world. So look, that was a lot to take in. We know that's a lot to take in. You may need to watch the replay. But for those of you that are crystal clear and you're like, yes, this makes total sense. If you've got any questions, now is the time to type them into the chat. I'm going to start going through some of the questions that we get. But if there's any new questions that you want to get answered, um, just pop them in the chat and I will keep on top of them. So one of the main questions that we get is, if I'm new to all of this, is it better to start off with FX or cryptos? Yeah, good question. Um, you know, like if I was, I think the best way of, of answering that question is if I was recommending a friend, crypto is really right now. It's really right now. Um, is it not, is it going to be an opportunity in a year's time? Absolutely. But the, right now, for me, the biggest opportunity is, is now. So I would say it's a tough one. FX is easier, slower from that point of view. But cryptos have, you're, you're, with crypto, you're investing and trading. And there's a little bit more to it. But I would personally, if it, right, in, in, from what I'm seeing from the markets and the opportunities, I would go with crypto personally at number one. But then once you make money from crypto, you can go, then go back to FX. Because FX, I still trade FX. It is, it's my bread and butter. It's what I've made my career from. So I cannot knock it. But sometimes you just got to move, and and you can do both. You can, if you're if you're able to, you can do both. But I'd probably go with cryptos myself if I was if I was recommending for a friend. Cool. And just to let you know, I've put the the link to the order page in the comment section. So you can go there now to take action um, if you're ready. Otherwise, we've got some more questions. Um, what do you mean when you say putting money into spot? Great question. So there's two ways of trading investing. Um, one is by just using all of your money and then buying the, the cryptocurrency uh, with your money and then so that's called spot trading. And then the other way of doing it is simply by using margin, so leverage. Now, even for long term, you can borrow some. So let's say you've got $10,000 in your account. You might say, Do you know what, I'm going to borrow, I'll borrow $3,000. You pay a little bit of interest. But now if you think, right, I think Bitcoin's going to go much higher. You could take that three thousand dollars that you wouldn't have otherwise had, and invest it into Bitcoin. That's called margin trading. With spot trading, you're basically not borrowing, and you're just putting only the money that you have um, into that into that position. And then this leads nicely into so if someone is looking to start, but they haven't got much money, maybe they've got five hundred dollars to spare. Um, what's the amount that they can trade with margin and how would they manage the risk? So, good question. I would say $500 you can start um, because that's what's been proven. No, I mean, before, before doing this with so many students, I would have probably said, you know, start with one or 2,000, but I've seen so many people now starting, starting with just $500 and growing it 
that I actually believe that you can actually do it with $500. Um, and in a way, like if you've got less money, like doing margin trading correctly um, is really the only way of doing it to grow fast enough. Because you want to turn your 500 into 1,000, 2,000 fairly quickly by taking good risk managed trades. But like if you're 5X and 10X in like the trade that I just showed, you know, if you're 4X and 5X in quite regularly, your money is going to grow quite quickly. So $50 risk, you've made $250 return, right? For example, like even if you go a little bit less than $50, you can quickly grow that $500 into $1,000, $1,000, and you can go from there. So I'd say $500 would be the, um, would be the minimum. And then for, for, for people who are totally new, um, what's the safest platform to start to start their trading account with? Well, with cryptos, I we we depending on where you are, um, we have a couple of brokers that we we recommend. Um, in as a general principle, you want to go with with it, with the exchanges that have the the highest amount of of volume. And right now, the number one exchange for that is Binance. Um, Binance is still the number one cryptocurrency exchange. Now, for those that are based in London, they had some issues with the FCA. Um, that's going to go across to everybody, by the way. So you may have problems opening up an account there, in which case there's um, other accounts like FTX. And if you are going to go this alone, um, you know, reach out and we can send you um, a link where you get a discount on your fees. Okay, so it will be our, our referral link and we can send you the links to, the, to our recommended brokers. Um, but we're recommending these based on safety and, um, and I guess um, having used them ourselves. So that's kind of where I would always go with the bigger exchanges. But in, in essence, it's also prudent to uh, diversify and have multiple exchanges and don't have all of your cash, um, all of your coins on one exchange, because if that gets hacked, then you know, you're, you're not going to be able to get that money back, potentially. And just to clarify, guys, the price is £1,297. Or you can, that's for the one-off payment, or you can split it into three payments. So three monthly installments of £497, just to clarify that. Um, yeah, so if you need with a payment, with, that's it. Exactly. Um, what's the best way to set up alerts to track all of the trades that people will be finding? Um, I like to do it in trading view. Um, now, I have a specific method of doing it, but I have multiple alerts going off. But the most important thing is the alerts have to mean something. So you need to make sure that you are putting in all the information that you need on that alert. Otherwise, it's a bit pointless. So whether I receive that alert on my phone, whether I receive it, you know, whilst I'm nowhere near my PC, I know exactly what I need to do. And, and that otherwise alerts are not going to be very useful now and, and alerts are time sensitive you know if it's in the zone and you can't take the trade then they're worthless but uh, for me trading you is the best platform to use uh, to do that and then one of the um one of the bonuses is the master class so if you sign up within the next 48 hours instead of getting three hour so one three hour master class you get two three hour masterclasses, which doubles up to six hours live trading time with you, Andy. Can you just explain a little bit of what that is? Because there's so much information in this. I think that gets a little bit lost in, uh, in the translation. Yeah, I mean, essentially, it is being over my shoulder for three hours and I can't leave my desk. Um, I'm trading and I'm looking and I'm explaining, not just trading, I'm looking for trading opportunities. You're getting an insight into how I'm thinking. We're putting the education into practice. We are hunting for opportunities. We are planning for the week. You'll see me putting my alerts in. You'll see me planning for trades. 
So there might not be a trade. It's a Saturday, right? Liquidity is lower. But normally we'll find one or two trades. But even if we didn't find trades for any reason, we'll have trades set up that might go off on Monday or Tuesday. So even if we physically aren't in the trade, we'll set alerts and we'll put orders in. So it's really getting an insight into what I'm doing. But most importantly, if you understand it and you want to follow what I do, you're more than welcome to. And a lot of my students do. But And that's absolutely fine. They, you know, they use it to kind of, I can't guarantee results, but I'm, you know, without kind of sounding like egotistic, I'm pretty good at what I do. So generally speaking, we will find some really great opportunities and essentially you can, you can follow along and, and jump, jump in with me um, if, you, if you feel like, it, if you feel ready for that. Um, so if you, and, and what sometimes, you know, we, we have the three hours and that's going to be great value anyway, but if you do sign up in the next 14 hours and you do get the next three hours, the following three hours are going to be even more beneficial because you're going to essentially have the experience at that point. You would have traded for yourself. You would have seen me live already. And then the next one, you'll be much more ready. And you'll be like, okay, now I get it. Now I'm going to, I'm going to go with Andy. That's what a lot of people do on the second session. Um, so, so yeah, I, I highly recommend, you know, if you're kind of on the fence, if you have the investment, you can, like I said, you have 14 days anyway to get your money back. So if, if you decide it's not for you, that's not a problem. Uh, but I can't imagine that you will decide it's not for you once you join and you see what's, what we've created is, um, you know, is changing lives, let's put it that way. So guys, we're coming to the end of the Q&A session. If there's any questions that you've got, just pop them in the chat and I'll pick them up. Um, but yeah, I just want to go back to that point on the masterclass because it's so true. The first one, there's a little bit, you know, you're putting all of the information of the course um, and it's really kind of just jumping into a whole new world. And I, I remember it classic. One of the first ones that we did um, with VeChain that you brought up, I'd never heard of VeChain before. And it was it just under or oh, just three. above three cents. Three cents. Three cents. Okay. And I, I was, was like, jumping even then, up and I, down, I, guys, <laughs> please. <laughs> I don't want to say this is not investment advice, but you might want to buy it. <laughs> I couldn't put it in a different way. <laughs> you might want yeah. to buy it. And I, and I didn't get it. I was like, what? well, it's only three cents. That's not going to do much. It didn't make any sense. And this is the thing, that formula of understanding where there's real true value. It's like, exactly. okay, it's three cents, but we can find another one for three cents. That is uh, worthless, right? So it's not, it's, it's understanding, right, this really had true value. And that's what we teach, obviously. Um, but yeah, that was a that was a great trade. Cardano at thirty cents, uh, and we can we can list so many. They they were very yeah. fortunate, but I've got I've got a lot more. There's still great opportunities right now, right now. And we're well, as we're saying in the show, it. yeah, every week in the show we're set, we're talking about new coins. So it's you know you trade Bitcoin and Ethereum pretty much as the main ones because they've got the most volatility and there's so many opportunities just in those, but there are these other altcoins. So what people call altcoins and even smaller cap coins as well. And, and going back to the VeChain example, it went from three cents for everybody that got into that, all the students, it went right up to 30 cents plus. So that's a 10 X investment. So whatever people could afford to put in or whether it was on margin or spot, whatever it was, that was a 10 X investment. Uh, and even know, just a, a crypto at three cents it's it's crazy how you can compound your gains um and it, it will take some people a little bit of time like me to get your head around it and then once you're in you just totally see so many more opportunities what were you going to say mate I can't no, do, do you know what the, the biggest thing with that is that you know it's one thing catching the bottom or catching that move but then it's also having the foresight to think well that we could have a pullback. And I remember we were having the, our coaching sessions and I was saying, look, uh, this is, I mean, uh, it's gone, it went further than what I thought it would go, but I was saying, look, this could pull back to 15, 14 cents when it was at 30. It did go lower than that. I didn't anticipate what happened. I'm not going to lie, you know, on live, live, but, and, Pete, and I remember people saying, no, no, no way. This is going, this is going to a dollar now. It's going to a dollar. And I said, just be careful. It's looking a bit toppy. 
we could easily do this 15 cent pullback and then the market might turn up. I remember sort of having these things in the um, in the coaching and like, um, yeah, in the end, I mean, I'm very grateful because I had a huge position, because I bought so cheap, I had a huge position on it, but I, I got out and I um, and I was looking at 15 cents, but eventually it went a lot lower and I've been accumulating at these lower prices. So, um, you know, so you have to, you can't just, you know, you caught a move, you can't just sit with your hands, you know, under your bum, basically. You need to, uh, you need to be active. If you if so, you want to um, get if you want to get the top top gains and that's the important thing so you can passively do it but to get top top gains like to make a lot of money from a little the more as I, as we explained in the presentation if you missed it go back and watch it you need to do all those four things. Cool. So we've got no more questions in in the in the chat. So I just want to wrap it up by asking this last question that we get a lot from people who are new to investing in general. They're really confused with the news and everything around crypto. So one minute cryptos is up, one minute it's down. They're really not sure when to kind of get involved in it. When's the best time to, to take action and, and get involved in cryptos as a general market space? in your opinion, as a professional trader? Well, look, the, the, the first thing that I'll say is from a trade, so if you asked me this two, three months ago when we were in the slump, I would still say now. Why? Because um, when you're trading, you can make money no matter what the market's doing. So when the market was kind of pulling back, ranging, not doing a lot, it was quite easy to make money just trading the range, you know, using our, our range trading tools but now the market's in a different phase and then in a probably in a month or two it's going to be in a different phase again so from a trading point of view these are skills that you're going to have no matter what the market is doing whether it's tanking down or going up and that's really reassuring for a lot of people but aside from that i believe right now um, we are getting primed for the next move higher. I believe we will be breaking the all-time highs on Bitcoin very soon. And I believe we'll be running to 80,000, maybe pulling back a little bit. And I think we'll be hitting 100,000 before the turn of the year. Now, I'm not saying this um, out of guesswork. I have a plan, as I've been talking about. My plan is we have a barrier that we need to clear. If that barrier gets cleared, as I've been explaining in the coaching and in, the, in, our, in our shows, there is nothing stopping Bitcoin. Okay, at the moment, that barrier is 50-52. Once we clear that path, we're going up. I can say that with confidence. Now, you're going to make money just by buying Bitcoin, for sure. I can be as sure as I possibly can be that you'll make money if you just go and buy Bitcoin. But the biggest thing you're going to miss if you don't do, um, if you don't learn, is the big money is going to be made in altcoins, the life-changing money, because Bitcoin is too big now. You're going to get a 10x. And a 10x on $1,000 is $10,000. On $10,000 is $100,000. I'm not saying that small amounts of money. It's still great. But you could get a Luna. You could get, as I was saying before, 5,000 turning into 1.3 million in a year. Not in 10 years, in a year. Think about that. 1.3 million with a $5,000 investor. Even if you say, oh, I wouldn't invest 5,000. $1,000 You're still 300,000 or whatever it is. So... One is learning how to identify where to put your money in the altcoins. The second thing is trading. Like today, for those that join late, simple. I, and I'm going to do a video tomorrow for you guys. But I took a trade and I pretty much caught the bottom of Bitcoin. And it ran to my target in half a day. Um, well, yeah, half a day, maybe six, seven hours. And I basically pretty much forexed my investment 
in those trades in half a day. Now think about it. I forex my investment. So now let's say you only put in, you put in a thousand, you've got 4,000. So now you have 4,000 tomorrow to invest. Maybe you don't invest all of these, maybe you still do a thousand. But at some point you can increase what you're investing and your account can grow so far. So then you take that profit. I normally would take half of that profit and I'd go and put it into the spot market and I just keep building and building my long-term portfolio. So I don't have to go into my cash, into my own bank to keep putting more money into cryptos. I generate it myself using the techniques that we teach. And I don't put my name on anything that doesn't work. So what I teach works. You've just got to follow the steps and you will make money. It's really that simple. It's whether you're ready for that commitment. And honestly, the time is now. Cool. So look, guys, thank you very much for watching and staying till the end. Um, that's everything. So I'm sure you'll agree it's a fantastic opportunity. And if it's one that excites you, here are your options. So you can pay in full for £1,297. If you do it within the next 48 hours, you get all the extra bonuses. Uh, and it's an amazing, amazing offer and package. If you want to spread the payments out, obviously we understand where the world is economically at the moment. So we've given you that option. You can make three monthly installments um, and you still get access to all the bonuses. So now it's up to you guys. You've got your choice. Like Andy said, you can go one way or you can go the other way. Um, we're going to leave that with you. Hopefully we've answered all your questions. If there is anything else that you want to ask us, just reach out to us. You can reach out to us in the group. So the Crypto and FX Traders Club on Facebook, or you can email us directly at info at londontradinginstitute.com. And we will endeavor to get back to you within 24 hours during normal working hours. So with that being said, is there anything else that you want to say before we go, mate? No, that's all really for me. I think we've, we've kind of, um, we've, you know, I've shared really everything that I've got to, to help people, um, you know, really make the right decision for themselves. Um, look, the reality is if you're interested in cryptos and you want to learn how to trade them and you want to learn how to do this properly, um, you know, the investment that you're making here today is really insignificant. Um, and you can make that back very, very quickly. But the knowledge that you're gonna learn is potentially life-changing. Plus the network that you're gonna build in our private group um, of like-minded people who are doing well, who are trading cryptos now, doing, being successful as I've showed you there, um, that is also priceless. You know, Surrounding yourself with the right people is also a key part to success. And you're gonna have us to guide you, answer your questions and coach you through the process. Um, it's a no-brainer in my opinion, but of course, everybody has to make that decision for themselves. So if you do join us, really looking forward to working with you. Otherwise, I do thank you for your time, guys. Uh, appreciate you being here um, on your evening, if you are from London or wherever. Like, um, and I appreciate Gavin for waking up extremely early um, to be here with us as well, who is based in Australia. So let's uh, wrap it up there, mate. Cool. Okay, guys, reach out to us if you've got any questions. Otherwise, the, the link to the order has been posted. Go and take action, uh, make a decision, and choose which path you want to go down. And hopefully, we'll see you all aboard the crypto train very soon. Other, otherwise, have a great day. Have a great evening. If you're on Andy's side of the pond, if you're on my side of the pond, have a great rest of your day. Um, and we'll speak to you shortly. Thanks. Take a lot, care, guys. guys. See ya.